Well, Happy New Year to everybody. 2023. I'm going to go ahead and get this thing started. There will be changes this year. Um, still going to fish a lot of tournaments, but I'm going to pick and choose some of the big tournaments. Um, one for sure that I'm going to get into is the U.S. Open. I've never fished it, um, but this is going to be the year I'm going to try it. So making all the preparations I can now for it, and uh, I look forward to fishing that. Um, also going to start putting the Region 6. Yes, I run uh, the California Bass Federation Region 6. I'm going to start putting some of the footage from there onto uh, basically my page. So if you want some of that content and or if you're one of the anglers that fish that, go ahead and check out my channel and that way you'll get the up-to-date information. Um, main reason that I uh, I'm doing that is trying to increase a number of um, participation I know a lot of people get on YouTube so if I can uh, post something and maybe uh, someone decides to become a weekend warrior and based on my channel that's just gonna help the overall Bass Federation So that's, uh, that's what I'm thinking hopefully we'll find out if it works but uh, that's what it is now some things I do want to get off my chest as for uh, the major circuits, um, BASS has changed things up. Uh, their AAA circuit is now uh, you have to fish all of the events instead of just fishing basically your division. Uh, BASS says this is a way that they can help those aspiring to be a full-blown pro uh, with the rigors of the Elite Series. Me, I see it a different way. I see it as a way to keep the old guard still still viable at the elite level. Now, a lot of us that are aspiring to take that jump or reach that highest level, we still have jobs. and It's kind of hard to get uh, time off. So if you have to get time off for six or nine tournaments just for one major circuit, yes, you're automatically fishing as a pro, but they know most people won't be able to do that. So what does that mean? Um, at the end of the year, when they tally up all the points, those spots in the Elite Series have to be filled. And it's a lot easier for television and for marketing to go ahead and have the old guard, the name that's already established, stay at that elite level than to turn over and have uh, the new guy show up. We all like our favorites, as seen when the initial split from BASS and everyone jumped to Major League Fishing, there was a lot of people upset with that and how could you be leaving? I don't want to watch Major League Fishing because Kevin Van Dam left BASS or whatever it may be. But that's my two cents. Uh, mentioned Major League Fishing. They decided to shake things up as well. Did some things with their, um, their AAA as well. Not really understanding too much of that, but um, similar situation. Another way to keep the old guard uh, in place. Also, they changed the format. Uh, one of the things that I thought was awesome was BAS had the five fish um, for the traditionalists, and that was one tournament which I love watching. Then Major League Fishing had the any any bass that's scoreable or any uh, anywhere as possible. All that other jazz that they promote, and I thought that was awesome too because it's basically the same sport but two different ways two different avenues to get to um, the highest level and it's always deciding which do, format do you think is best for you are you a person that can fish for five fish a day and win a tournament with 20 pounds or are you more like like myself who may not necessarily catch 20 pounds every time they go out but they can catch a lot of fish uh, a lot of scoreable fish, so um, I'm a little, little sad that they decided, uh, Major League Fishing decided to go to a five, five bass limit, uh, and the principle's still the same, still catch and release, so that's good as for conservation, but just a little weird that they're going back to the old format, and I know a lot of people like that, it's more, it's easier to follow and it makes more sense than, uh, for those, but I do, I do like seeing uh, someone catch a lot of fish to me that 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 means you're actually on it or on them vice or oh, I got five bites I got one and one end of the lake and three hours later I got another one another end of the lake so 
anyway, just wanted to chime in my two cents. 2023 should be exciting. Uh, look to providing more content and actually hearing from you. Till then, tight lines. Out.